Hi YouTube, um, Mr. JFX out here. I'd just like to say I'm sorry that I haven't been uploading any videos or anything lately. It's because I've been busy, I've just set up a clan and everything. And I was getting that sorted out. And I've also been editing for a clan as well. So I've been quite busy. So now I thought I'd just get a few videos in. And I'd just like to say thank you for all the subscribers and all the support everyone's been giving me. And I've just I had a few hours the other day so I thought I'd make a COD for a mod menu. So I thought today I'd show you a make a video on showing you how to do it. So yeah, it needs to be it's non jailbreak, but you have to be um, on bypass on COD4. So you need to go ahead and go into your network settings, then go into connection settings. It's okay. Right, then you need to go to custom and you just keep going across. So you get to proxy server and then you need to use it and as you can see you need to put a code in and the code's 210.101.131.231 I know you don't you think that you're gonna not remember it it's okay it'll be in the description it'll also be in the package when you download it part number needs to be 8080 then you enable that and then just go ahead save it but don't test the connection alright now you need to go if you haven't got Cod4 and you save data like I haven't then you can go down to the game play it and then when it loads up you need to go on to multiplayer I'm also I'm sorry about the this part of the video I'm recording with my iPod because I haven't got a screen recorder yet for my PS3 I'm hoping to get one working so yeah so when this goes it loads up you need to go down to multiplayer right when you're in multiplayer you can go ahead and quit the game when it comes up so yeah you want to go ahead quit the game Right, the game's now quit, so now you want to go ahead, go save data utility. And you need to go down to your Call of Duty 4. Go ahead, copy it. Copy it to your USB device. And now that's it for the PS3 for now. So, that's it. So yeah, I'll meet you back on the computer. You need to go ahead and open up the file, which is in a WinRAR or JZIP thing. For Mr. GFX World's Pod Farm on you, and the link to get this is in the description. And I'll put it in a Mediafire folder for you all so you can download it off Mediafire. So, yeah, so you want to go ahead and extract it. So, I'll extract my Pod Farm on you. So, yeah, when you've gone ahead and extracted it, you need to go ahead. Go to where the folder is, which I <coughs> the folder is on my desktop. So here it is, there. Look, see if it's got for mod menu. So, yeah, I'll minimize that and open up my usual disk. And as you can see, it's added me a new folder. So, I'll delete all these. Right, now here you're all your lobby tier 3. Right, and save it. Uh, and then, so yeah, right, let's start. So, what you want to go ahead and do first is go to the main part of the CFU menu. And in the folder that you just extracted, there is the bypass code, which is basically the code that I told, that I told you so if you need it, it's there. There's the instructions there if you need instructions. All you need at the moment 
this is the FX bar. Menu config, post config, developer. Go ahead and drag them underneath the PS3, like so. And then you need to go ahead and also, I have added my wallpaper for my PS3, which is there. So you can go ahead and also drag that into the folder as well. So now you've done that, you need to go ahead and go into PS3, save data, BLES. And then as you can see, here's the bar, just make sure it's bar. Click that once, it up there, like so. So now we're going to go ahead in the, the file that you've extracted. You need to go back onto there too. And you just want to copy all them, drag it into here. And if you put do this for the next two, and then just go copy and replace, like so. It will copy and replace them. Now to see if it's worked, you just click that, and as you can see, it's changed. So now you want to go ahead, and cross that, cross that, and I'll be need, meet you back on the PS3. Hello YouTube, back onto the PS3 now. So yeah, all you want to go ahead and do is I'll show you. Oh, sorry, I'm that. Sorry. Is this is the wallpaper I was on about? So if you go ahead, go to Control Panel, and set as wallpaper. Go ahead, enter. Yeah. Right. So now, as you can see, it's a good wallpaper. So yeah. So what you want to go ahead and do? Is go back into Save Data Utility. Go to your USB device. Go that and go copy it yep yeah. yep yeah. so you want to copy it as you can see now to see if it's worked it should say there as you can see if I zoom in a bit that's what it'll look like so yeah now what you want to go ahead and do is go up and load up Call of Duty God 4 to load up right it should come up with this error message saying Mr. GFX Lads mod menu visit youtube.com forward slash user forward slash Mr. GFX for updates if this pops up then it means you've done it right so yeah you want to go ahead and exit it go down to multiplayer wait for multiplayer to load up Right, then you need to go ahead, click play online. Alright, as you can see up there, look, Mr. GFX lad in green. So, now you need to go ahead and go to private match, start the game. Now the game started, you go ahead and go to auto sign. Say welcome to Mr. GFX Live PS3 mod menu, so I'll just click. Any. Alright, so now you can click down. There's all these menus, it's little things here. I can go ahead, press select the full menu. Uh, the vision, low divisions, uh, profile, cheat menu, quite a lot in there, and there's the elevator menu. Here 
hear them. And then there's obviously the game modes. Perk menu. Oops. Right, that's the main menu. And then there's the second menu, which has got the host menu. Um, and there's also weapon menu. I give, I give myself all. Um, you, there's all. So, uh, there's also 8130 menu, empty menu. So if you want to add anything of your own, you can message menu. Um, there's player control menu. You can make them walk, lay down, throw, tea bag, or shoot. There's a good infection menu, you can do teleport, teleport v2, bots, third person, 10th, 11th. That's just a, and then there's a D rank, every menu has to have a D rank. So yeah, so as you can see, if I press keep swapping guns, as you can see, it goes through all the guns. I'll zoom in down here, look. There you go. Oh, uh, yeah, that's about it. I hope you have fun with my menu. And I wish you all the best. If you get any problems, then please comment and I'll try to help you. Please subscribe to my channel. It's helping me out at the moment. I'm going to be uploading some more videos soon. Um, so, yeah, that's about it. Peace.